Welcome back to the month of paradox with 90 second philosophy and carnades.org. Today we are going to be looking at two paradoxes. We're going to be looking at Barry's paradox and the syllable paradox because they are extremely similar. Let's take a look. So Barry's paradox was named for G.G. Barry and it was refined and published by Bertrand Russell. So the question is what is the smallest positive integer not definable in 10 words or less? There must be some number that takes more than 10 words to define. It would seem that 142 quintillion 857 quadrillion 192 trillion 832 billion 124 million 875 thousand nine probably does. Yet if it was, it could be defined as the smallest positive integer not definable in under 11 words, which is itself under 11 words. And so it's not the smallest positive integer not definable in less than 11 words. Similarly, what's the smallest positive integer not definable in 23 syllables or less? This big number might seem to be at first appearance, Yet, if it was, once again, it could be described as the smallest positive integer not definable in under 24 syllables. Therefore, all positive integers are definable in 23 syllables or less, and all positive integers are definable in 10 words or less. This seems very counterintuitive, so we end up with a paradox. The question for you, of course, is, is this paradox veridical, falsitical, or antinomious? Write your answers and explanation why in the comments below. Watch a new Paradox video every single day this month, and stay skeptical, everybody.